getting wonderful local writers who are fiction writers, novelists, short story writers, nonfiction writers, poets, uh, essayists. We'd love eventually to expand the, the, uh, the lecture series to musicians, to artists, to other thinkers, historians, photographers, people who are broadly involved in, in creation and creative lives. And we want to bring those people here, not just for our students. Lily spent a, the bulk of her day with our kids. She spent them with ninth graders, 11th graders. She gave an address to the upper school. She was inspiring, engaging. Kids came out with their eyes lit up, excited, going home to their moms and saying, it made my day. I talked to Lily King, and it made my day. And I learned this, and I learned that. And I want to be writing. I want to know more about this. And I want to have this more as part of my life. So that's one of our aims, is to connect our, these fabulous local resources with our students. But the other aspect that we're interested in is connecting uh, NYA to our community, to our broader community. We want to invite Yarmouth in. Um, Robert Frost famously said, good fences make good neighbors. Uh, I think open doors do too, actually. I much more find that much more appealing, the idea of opening gates wide, opening arms wide and saying, we're here. We've got lots to share. We have wonderful faculty, wonderful students, a terrific community of parents, and let's bring everybody in to celebrate. So your job is to spread the word the next time